the Transcendental Politics Pocket Parable and Pocket Information Packet Tutorial, where I will show you how to fold pocket parables and the one pocket information packet called Synopsis of Transcendental Politics. So the first thing you have to do is cut along the borders until you are right at the print. You do not want any margins, so to speak of. You want the the paper to be trimmed right to the print as close as possible. A paper cutter is ideal, but if you use scissors, just use a steady hand and keep a straight line and stay as close to the print as you can. Um, the first fold is lengthwise, two folds. One lengthwise so that the crease is just before the beginning of the title, synopsis. And you want it to either be perfectly straight or to taper ever so slightly so that it becomes just imperceptibly narrower at the bottom. And to do that, you want your, your back lip to be a little higher than your front lip, just a fraction of a millimeter higher than your front lip. And then you do the same thing on the other side, on the right side, you fold, you fold so that lengthwise so that it is at the end of the S on politics. And there we go. And you have this lengthwise piece of paper folded back before and after the title of the pocket information packet. Your next folds are going to be this way. And the first one will be under the Transcendental Politics logo. Um, in the case of the synopsis of Transcendental po Politics, the pocket information packet, you want it to be immediately below. You want the crease to be tangential to the bottom of the circle. Okay. Uh, the next fold will be just above the title. Again, folding in the same direction. So now you have it folded like this, just below the logo, just above the title. And your next fold, your next and last fold, is to fold this long part in half so that this end reaches this crease, the inside of this crease. There we go, like this. Then crease it, and that is your flap that you will tuck in to the pocket that you've created over here. So now you open up the pocket and you take this flap and you bend it, you bend it and you tuck it in and you work it down into the pocket behind the logo. Gently pull, gently pull on this. You don't want to tear it and work it down and you have a Transcendental Politics Pocket Information Packet. Our handy invention about the size of a business card, not much thicker than a business card, that you can have in your wallet or uh, in your purse and can distribute it to people at will. You could have a few of these to pass out if you're interested in helping to inform the world about Transcendental Politics. Now let's try a couple of others. This is pocket parable number one. So pocket parable number one, it's the same thing. There's going to be some slight differences in terms of the fold below the Transcendental Politics logo. So we do this lengthwise again, just before the A. We do it lengthwise just after the E in parable. So we have a transcendental politics parable um, in the middle of this lengthwise paper with the edges going right up to the, end, the beginning and end of the title. Again, we fold below the transcendental politics logo, but this time not tangential to the circle, but with maybe a you know half centimeter of rim below it. Okay. And then we're going to again fold above the title. 
above the title, a transcendental politics pocket parable, and then again fold the length part, the longest part, halfway into the inner elbow of the crease at the title. And there we go. And then again, we tuck it in. And we have a little clumsy. And we have pocket parable number one. So the pocket parables are distinguished only by their numbers. There is no, the title is the same, a transcendental politics pocket parable. This is pocket parable number one. Now, let's try one that's considerably different. Transcendental politics pocket parable number six. I mean, by considerably, almost exactly the same with one twist at the end. So again, we do the lengthwise folds just before the A on the left side, just before the A on the left side. And just after the E of parable on the right side. Mm -hmm. Again, we fold it below, not immediately below with the pocket parables. You gently, you generally leave a little bit of white below the logo. Unlike with the um, synopsis pocket information packet where you, where the crease is tangential to the symbol. And then again, right above Transcendental Politics Pocket Parable. The next crease is right above Transcendental Politics Pocket Parable. But this time, because this, this is so long, if we folded it in half, the flap would be too big. So we're going to fold two lines above this paragraph here. And you can experiment. You don't have to remember exactly where the fold goes. You can experiment and figure it out, as I did uh, when I was folding this. And then you see it goes a little bit below the crease. And that just gets folded in to the flap. So you have a little extra. You have a little extra there that's folded to create the flap. And now you tuck it in. And with Pocket Parable 7, you have to do uh, a little bit of that as well. You have to do the fold. Um, you have to make the flap short enough. Uh, it's just the tiny bit you need, really. This one needs a little more. Um, and that is how you make our pocket information packets and our pocket parable uh, in a nutshell. Now, I will have in the comments a link to a document that has links to all of the pocket parables and to the um, information packet. And I will, uh, currently that's um, to, doc, do, the, to Google Docs, but I will try to replace it with um, PDFs so that there are no formatting issues. Okie dokie. Thank you for stopping by. And please feel free to print these out, trim them, fold them, and distribute them to help spread the word about transcendental politics. Have a wonderful day.